To display a list of parallax images, we simply create a list view inside the body which has 15 items. And now as we can see here we have a simple list view of 15 different images without any scrolling effect. And now we wrap our image widget with the flow widget and introduce a new flow delegate class that control how its children are sized and where those children are painted. So the first method returns the tight width constraints for our image the child widget. We still need to calculate the vertical position of each background image based on its scroll position and the global key inside our flow delegate which we will assign inside our image widget. So now we will start to implement the layout calculation for the parallax effect. So inside the paint children method first we calculate the pixel position of a list item and after that we will determine the person position of the list item within the scrollable area. After that we use the vertical alignment along with the size of the list item and the background image that determines where the background image should be positioned. Now by using the child rig we produce the parallax effect on the background image. And at the end we will implement the show repaint method as below. And now you can see we have a list view with a parallax effect in the background image.